Uh, a couple of quick questions. Uh, I do want to take you back to January of 2023. Uh, just how nervous were you before Pathan release? Like you said in your speech, these are not my words, your words. People were writing you off, death knell, you know, Shah Rukh doesn't deliver hits anymore. How nervous were you before Pathan released? Um, I, I don't know if I was nervous, uh, but I was very scared. Mm -hmm. uh, nervous is an easier word. You know, when you're nervous, when you're coming here to say a speech, you're nervous when you're going to a party that you're not invited to. <laughs> <laughs> but you're scared, you know, because <clears throat> honestly, this is all I know, that I know only to act and entertain people. And I've done it now for many, many years, more years than I remember. I counted when I'm writing a speech, it's 33 years plus. But this is all I know how to do. So you're scared that if this doesn't entertain people, it's not about the monies, it's not about the box office. If this doesn't entertain people, what else am I going to do? So I was very scared. In the interim, during the COVID times, yeah. I even learned how to make Italian food, just in case Pathan didn't work. <laughs> and thank God for that. But, but do tell me, I mean, at some point when the movie released, maybe on the first day or the pre-release, you would have got that inkling, you would have got that instinct, that yeah, picture will go. When was that? So, because of COVID, <clears throat> uh, the people who made Pathan, Adi and Siddharth and everyone, all of us formed a group because we used to play, we play poker at night. We don't gamble, <laughs> just play without money, okay? Don't fool me for this and say this. It's just love that we share. I've lost a lot of love in the last two years. So, <laughs> So we play poker and we sit down and the movie had released and we all got together and we said, okay, we'll find out. But genuinely, Zaka, I'm not showing off. There came a time because this is an unexpected kind of a business of a film. Nobody had seen business like this. Even the Yashraj film people who've made the biggest of it. Uh, you know, nobody had seen how it will um, go like this. So after about two, three days, it became just unbelievable. And I'm like, oh, these are the numbers? No, 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 this can't be. Poker me panch lakh ki chal. I swear we don't play with money. Okay, this is a joke. This is a joke, everyone. Okay. No, and and uh, one movie is incredible in and of itself, but to have two thousand crore plus, and then again, Dunkey, three big movies back to back in a single year. I can't remember the last time you've had three big hits in a single year. Was that planned, or this is the mother of all comebacks? You planned it this way, or it just so happened? No, this is this is just the simple truth. <coughs> me. Badsha, me badsha. I've been told not to be arrogant and mean and stupid. But yeah, this is uh, unexpected. But like I said, I honestly believe with all humility and genuine gratitude that uh, somewhere this is not about coming and watching a film. I think all the Indians, I genuinely deserve this award because all the Indians came out in hoods. I know people who don't even like me as an actor, two, three in 140 crore people. But, <laughs> but there are some who would tell me, you know, I don't regularly watch your films, but I know friends and people calling me from all over the world and said, you know, we wanted to come out for Pathan. We wanted to come out for Jawan and just be supportive of what you do as an actor and as, um, as a person, as a father, as a family man, as whatever. So I know this is way beyond uh, the goodness of the films. The Jawan was lovely. I think Pathan is fantastic. Danke is beautiful. But it is way beyond. And I think my directors and producers recognize that so. So it's with big gratitude. It's not a comeback. It is actually a reiteration of the fact that I belong and I should continue to act and not learn pasta and pizza. <laughs> and that can wait. You know, we are incredibly grateful that those movies worked and you made the comeback. But like you said, it was not about Shah Rukh, the individual alone. The industry itself was going through a bit of a crisis. I mean, people were saying, oh, Hindi film industry doesn't know how to make good movies anymore. South is making better movies. You know, script writers are not grounded anymore. And you changed all of that. So it went beyond just an individual Shah Rukh Khan or one movie. This was about putting confidence back in the industry because people had stopped coming to the theaters because of COVID. Yeah, it was, it was really bad times. And, you know, they call it the post-pandemic time when uh, theaters were running empty, specifically the Hindi-speaking theaters. And yes, we had some wonderful people who were sending us to Chand and Moon and also making films here in Hindi now, the guys from the South. And uh, yes, they do make larger-than-life films. Uh, Hindi films perhaps had started making cinema, which was a little more middle of the road. But there is now a youthful audience 
out in the country you know we are one of the youngest or the youngest country in the world yeah. and i guess they just want things which are bigger better faster superior over the top and maybe a little noisy <laughs> and uh, happier you know and middle of the road real cinema may have because you know this was years of uh, films which were lying in the cans had to come down post covid so i think now we are finding the groove in hindi cinema and i cannot take the responsibility of bringing hindi cinema back and i can just take uh, i i can really uh, just thank everyone that i happened to be in those films which started the trend of hindi cinema being watched again and we are extremely thankful i i say this on behalf of the whole hindi film industry and the whole indian film industry that it's really nice that people are coming back and doing this community watching it's not just the ott it's not just the satellite stuff uh please do keep watching cnn news 18 but beyond that <laughs> uh, do watch a film in the theater thank you for that you don't, you don't cable as well as on social you don't get cnn news 18 in theaters yet so <laughs> till such time uh, i i think it's uh, i think it's very humbling for all of us as workers as actors as producers as directors and hope this trend continues you talked about bigger better fast superior south movies mr mani ratnam is here and the last time you two worked was what 20 years ago 30 years ago Are you going to make a pitch for a, another movie? When is he going to direct you again? You can ask him. Use the forum of CNN News 18 Indian of the Year. <laughs> Mani sir, what now? It's all come out in the open now. <laughs> I'm requesting you. I'm begging you. I'm telling you every time do a film with me. I swear this time I'll dance on top of a plane. Chaiya chaiya if you tell me. What is the train? <laughs> can somebody pass Mani sir a mic please? And good evening Swasni. I had told you that time tell him before sleeping Shah Rukh Shah Rukh Shah. Mani sir when are you going to cast Shah Rukh Khan? When I buy a plane. Oh, <laughs> buy a plane. If I buy a plane, I'll do it. <laughs> Mani let me just tell you the way my films are going. <laughs> this this plane is not far away, huh? I I'll bring it down to earth don't worry I am coming I am coming on it kinjidi tik tik ko punjidi tik tik ko chandadadadadadadanu All right so 